Shea Bear 1000 here. Today we've got another product. We're going to review the Shine Armor. It's an as seen on TV product. This was bought at the Dollar General for $20. And we're going to see if it does what it says it's going to do. Stick around and let's see if it's worth the money. Okay guys, so like I said, this was $20 at the Dollar General. So, a uh, quick and easy way to clean, shine, and protect. Great for cars, trucks, motorcycles, RV, boats, and more. We got this orange tractor here. We're going to try it on that. It's metal. It's painted. Advanced ceramic formula. Fast. Done in minutes. Easy. Spray on application. Lasts. Never wax your car again. Okay. Well, first of all, make your car shine like new. Well, I have never seen a car go from this to this without buffing it and I mean rubbing it out with rubbing compound buffing it and all that crap so ceramic coat your car ceramic coat for your car simple spray on application never wax your car again I don't believe it waterless wash hmm shine and protect so see there's some pictures before and after I don't believe it um, the advanced three-in-one ceramic coating. Well, let's open this up and let's see if this says if it does what it says it's going to do. So you get there should be two of these. Yep, there's two of these application towels. Here's our stuff. Nice little purple color. We've got a card in here. Directions. Okay, let's read these. These are not very long. Spray onto a clean, damp microfiber cloth and onto the surface you are cleaning. Approximately three foot by three foot. We're just going to do a little spot. Two, gently wipe the surface with the first pre-wetted folded microfiber cloth. That's why they give you two. Quickly switch to a clean folded dry microfiber cloth and buff off remaining haze before it dries. I could have sworn on here it said no buffing. Let's see. I could have sworn I read this last night and said no buffing. N no buffing. Just spray and wipe away. Now here it says quickly switch to a clean folded dry microfiber cloth and buff off remaining haze before it dries. Buff off. No buffing idiots it is made in the USA by the way so okay four repeat this process until the entire vehicle is clean streak free and ultra glossy safe to use on glass paint I would hope so metal and plastic what why would you use it on glass but it, it says no buffing in here it says buffing so I don't know let's go ahead I'm gonna get one of these cloths out got my niece my niece is bringing her Chevy Suburban over she's having a couple issues with it not wanting to go in the park and also it's um, I guess she's having trouble with it stalling too so alright now I'm going to take this in the house and I'm going to get it damp and then we'll bring it out. We'll do exactly what the instructions say. We'll see if it works. 
Okay, so here's a good before and after. I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to do this this section right here. I'm going to leave this alone and leave this alone. And let's see what happens. I've got this one. It's damp. Now the first step says to spray onto the cloth. It says to spray onto the cloth. Okay, let's see if it's got a spray nozzle in it. No spray nozzle. There is no spray nozzle in here. It even shows spray nozzle. Jesus. So much pride in their work anymore. I mean, it's no wonder people get depressed. You spend twenty dollars on something, you don't even get the whole damn thing. So how are you gonna spray it? I mean Alright. Now it says Gently wipe the surface with the first pre-wetted folded micro cloth. Okay. There's that. Now it says, quickly switch to a clean folded dry microfiber cloth and buff off the remaining haze. Okay. Somebody must be here. Let me go see who's out front. Okay guys, I'm back. Sorry about that. This is what we came up with. And uh, I don't see a damn difference. I don't see a bit of difference in that. It says gently. I'm going gently. Quickly rub off the haze. I don't see a difference, guys. I don't see I don't see a difference at all. Nope. I'm gonna say no. Alright, let's go back in the garage and we'll do some final thoughts on this. This stuff, I usually don't take stuff like this back, but this is going back because number one, it's not all there, and number two, it's junk and it's 20 bucks. Okay guys, so in conclusion, this stuff, don't waste your money. Even if it's on sale for $5, even if it's on sale for $1, don't buy it. It doesn't do anything. It's a waste of money, especially for $20. bucks. i will tell you right now that I have never, if you want your car to look like that, first of all, your paint job better be good. If, if the... Uh, if the clear coat's peeling off your paint, nothing's going to help it. But if your paint job's good, the clear coat's good, you've got to work hard to get your car to shine. You've got to buff it. You know, you've, you know, first, you know, you got to rub it out with rubbing compound. You got to buff it with that stuff, and then you've got to buff it with, with your um, polish, and then you've got to put a coat of wax on it. Nothing is going to spray on and wipe off and make your car look like that. I'm sorry, but that's just the way it is. And for 20 bucks, they are absolutely ripping people off. And not just because it didn't come with everything. It's because it does not work. It does not do what it says it'll do. It didn't even really clean anything. You can, 
it, you know, soap and water look better than what this stuff does. No, it's junk and um, don't buy it. Like I said, this, if Monkey still got the receipt, we just bought it last night. So if she still got the receipt, I'm taking this back because I'll never use it. It's no good for nothing. If I can't take it back, I'll have two microfiber claws that I just spent $10 a piece on, you might as well say. No, it's junk. Don't buy it. It's a ripoff. It's a scam. Nothing can do that. It's like the woman that checked us out last night. She said, uh, well, let me know how that does. And I said, well, I can pretty much tell you right now it's not going to do that because I know if you want your car to look like that, you got to do a lot of hard work. Um, even if you got a got a hand buffer, you know, a power buffer, it still takes some time to get these to to get your car to look good like this. You know, uh, hand, especially if you're doing it by hand. Yes, sometimes you might even have to start out with 1500 grit sandpaper. Go to 200 or 1500 grit sandpaper. Go to 2000 grit sandpaper, and then on up to 3000 grit sandpaper. Then you you do your rubbing compound, then you put your polish on, and then you wax it for protecting. Nothing's going to make your car look like that. So anytime you see something like that, don't believe it. It's junk. But I wanted to do this video so people don't go out and spend their hard-earned money on shit like this. And then go, well, you know, I've had it a month. I don't know where the receipt is. Dollar General won't take anything back without a receipt. They won't even exchange anything without a receipt even though you got 20 of them back here on the shelf you know it came from here it doesn't matter so you know and and that watch that i bought from there that smart watch i've had some comments on that and i'm going to do an update on that video about how people tell me i'm not using it right you know well this guy he he's not up on on electronics you know he's not electronic savvy look i know how to scan a code and I'll, sh I'll show that to you guys and um, you know like I said that was junk too so don't buy anything if you want a good smart watch buy you a good smart watch if you can't afford it just wait you know I can't afford one either but you know so, but I thought I'd try it for you and I try this for you but this hopefully is going back so anyway guys there you go two thumbs down don't even don't even pay 50 cents for it at at a garage sale unless you want the microfiber claws because this is no good it does not it does not work you know it, and somewhere i seen on here where it said guaranteed and um it's just it's just not going to work guys so anyway shea bear the myth the man legend I'm gone for now it's getting hot again already and um we'll see you guys soon thanks for watching bye bye and don't believe everything you read on the box. Five stars, 5,000 plus trusted customer reviews. Well, you can print that on anything.